Those don't need to be your last words. Who the fuck are you? Does the name William Miles ring a bell? The assassin? Then you know who I am. We, the assassins, have been watching you. It's unusual for an Abstergo employee to take an interest in a country's revolution. You're not wrong there. We know about your work with the Animus. Astounding what you and Deanna were up to. D. They played you, didn't they? Sophia Ricken made you so many promises. Enough! We're not talking about her. Sure. Plenty of other subjects to cover on our ride to Alexandria. Don't assume I'm going anywhere with you. Well, let's look at your options. You can come with me, or you can stay here and do the dance of death again and again until you make a mistake. They only need you to make one. There's no going back to your old life, Layla. I never planned to. But you'd finally be able to work on the Animus project. Our version of it. And with us, you'd always have the freedom to do things your way. Fine. Let's do this. That doesn't mean I'm on your side. Good enough. <laughs> These articles on hidden chambers. Always so misguided. Always missing crucial information. Best way to avoid this jerk is to get back in the Animus. Is that for Foxidas? A gift? No. It's a relic. I don't want to talk about it, Demastis. Isn't that Bayek's? Let me have it. I'll give it to Foxidas myself. He loves these things. I'll kill you. How about that? I'm in no mood for compromise today. Past Neopolis in the crack of morning. With strong wind, you'll be standing in Rome's forum in uh, two days' time. It's over between you and Bayek, eh? I can feel. No decision is easy. But you are a chosen one. And now you are free! <laughs> like me! So begins a new day. Don't drop your guard entirely. We should assume they are expecting us. 
you sound thrilled about? Eager, old man. Eager to be done with this scum. Let's move on to the next pile of scum. Infinite scum! Such is the world we live in! will summon their navy. Prepare yourselves! Here they come. Forward men! Litter the sea with their shattered hulls. Tricors! When this day is out! If that happens, Bokida, I will wear seaweed like a siren and sing them myself. I will hold you to that. Believe me, you would be sorry. Now let's end this! Too tightly formed. They'll hit us. We are overwhelmed. The hell ships are too many. We must sink them before they reach us. Then do us if they strike us. Take them down. Fire ship front. Close by the gods, they're everywhere. We're under fire. Fire ships left. We're under fire. Fire. Golly, speed. Fire ship left! Fire! Ready to fire! Great and girthy whale! 
but we'll dance around their folk like minnows in a pond. You won't get right in your youth where you boxed us. Oh, 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 I couldn't be like this. The philosophy there too. Ah, what we should it be? A million things, Geraya. You must write your memoirs one day. I may just do. And if you promise to sneak one copy into the library, I'll let you live on. Surely this chapter will be the most widely read of all. The rest! Today, we sail together! What port are you taking us to? There's a town called Antium I'd like to try. Lots of merchants sail in and out of there. Should be safe for you. From there, it's a half day's ride to Rome. It is only a matter of days before Caesar will officially become a tyrant. There he is. The people love you, Caesar. You're a god. The Senate will not bow to reason. A parliament of clucking hands. Let me be your wolf. Caesar is the king of the order now. Caesar is the father of understanding. You and Caesar will die. You are meddling with the affairs of the order. The order is greater than Rome. Go back to Egypt with the rest of the liars and slaves. Huh. You make me understand why murder is just. I command armies. I control greatness. I will erase your order from the annals. Kneel to Caesar. Kneel to Rome. It feels good to fight the winners. We 
We are the writers of history. Caesar will follow you to a Your son pissed himself in the night. I will feed your heart to punches. You have no honor. You stole everything from me. I am a Gabignani. I thought you would scurry away, little one. You'd have taken your chance to drop off the map. Flavius isn't here to save you, Septimius. No Roman deal can be made. My son's heart, for your life. Was revenge everything you hoped? You and the Medjai shall drench the sheets with your sweat tonight. <laughs> this stuff. With the order, I served them and your beloved Egypt. And I'll be rewarded in the afterlife. An eternity. Drinking and whoring with my brothers. The only thing that waits for you is oblivion. For your name, your order, and the rotting corpses of your Gabignani. Up and devour your fetid heart. rest of the Senate. This place is crawling with soldiers.
I ask only this, that you join with me in building a new Rome. A Rome with you as king? Let Caesar speak! We want a Rome that offers justice, peace, and land to all its citizens, not just the privileged few. You are just as privileged as I. I am not dictator for life. An honor bestowed upon me by the people of Rome. Would you have me refuse such a gift? We would have you think of Rome before yourself. I will unite the Republic. Senatus Populusque Romanus. For the Senate and the people of Rome! Republic? You speak of Republic while coveting a crown? Marcus Antonius offered me the crown at the Lupercalia festival. I refused it. And what a pretty play it was! You don't need a crown. They have made you a god! Mark me, Gaius Cassius Longinus. Support me in my dreams for Rome, and old divisions will be forgotten. Senators! The war is over! The drums of dissent have reached a fever pitch. Rome will not be a monarchy again. It seems Brutus would start a revolution. But against what, my friend? We desire the same things. How can you say that when you have raised yourself so far above the people? I speak for the people. You have seized the rights of the citizenry. No. The people infused with fear and blinded by patriotism offered up all of their rights to their leader and did it gladly so. Who made you leader of Rome? The eternal city herself. Caesar will not be reasoned with. Senators, we still have a voice in this forum. I will hear your complaints. Caesar deigns to listen. Romans rejoice. You are free now! Do I know you? You who strikes from the shadows. The same fate will come to all despots. In the end, it is impossible not to become what others believe you are. And I was a god! There is a new creed now. Yeah! Rome is eternal! She will never fall to you or your kind. Freedom is not given, Caesar. Requiescat in pace, Caesar. Do you know what you've done? Caesarian would have sat on the throne of Rome. Listen to the cries in the streets. They call you a dead tyrant's whore. I am still your queen. You are a queen of liars and snakes. I fought for you for five years. Our people worshipped you. Apollodorus died for you, for Egypt. For Egypt? I am Egypt! <laughs> then be the ruler our people deserve. Or nothing will save you from my blade across your throat. 
You are the last of the pharaohs. <laughs>